Thanks for rolling up to Bill Marley and his certified pothead. Smoking on one of my uh early afternoon J's, bro. Do you know what we need to do, bro? RT and you run those numbers up, break down, subscribe, twist up those like button. Let's go ahead, and jump into uh today's story and shit, bro. And tonight, two local businesses teaming up to host a very unique fundraiser for Ukraine. 7 Action News reporter Brett Cass tells us how the cannabis dispensary and food truck operator started this collaboration for a worthy cause. Okay, hold on, hold on. So we got, we got a, uh, a dispensary and a food truck uh, getting together to, uh, to uh, uh, benefit Ukraine. You know what I mean? I'm all for that. Uh, Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see what they doing though. Pot and pierogi. You probably didn't think these two things would go together, but they will be together here on Sunday in Detroit to raise money for Ukrainian children. A luxury loud in Cork Town, they grow pot and sell pot. But new to the menu this weekend, potato. True OG, you see that bag, bro? Potato pierogi. It's a little more unique, yeah. Pot and pierogi kind of catches people's attention for some reason. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What, what are they doing? They, uh... They put weed in the pierogies? Grow pot and sell pot. But new to the menu this weekend, potato pierogi. It's a little more unique, yeah. Pot and pierogi kind of catches people's attention for some reason. And they do go well together, actually. Marco Melanowski is the engineering manager at Luxury Loud and a first-generation Ukrainian-American. Growing up in Hamtramck, he and many of his friends have a strong connection to their homeland. We just all... Mm, I feel you, bro. You know what I mean? Ukrainians, you know what I mean? Uh, 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 need to stick together, bro. Let's, let's see what y'all doing. I have a lot of family back home. Some of us have heard from them. Some of us have not. Um, so it just affects us deeply, just in a different way than anything else. So in the midst of war, the employees at Luxury Loud came up with an idea to help Marco and everyone in Ukraine. Seeing what um, a lot of our friends were going through, you know, and, and just hearing about it, um, wanting to do something. On Sunday, Luxury Loud will donate 100% of all cannabis sales to benefit children in Ukraine. They also enlisted the help of Shrodex and Hamtramck to provide pierogi along with kielbasa for a donation. What do you think when you brought that's, the that's, that's dope, bro. Pierogi, yeah. I, I, that's dope, bro. Donating 100% of the sales to, to the kids in Ukraine because, yo, yo. Don't no kid need to be going through that, bro. That's that's just that's just not me straight up and down. And then uh for stoners, you know what I mean, to be doing this shit, bro. Yo, that makes me that makes me happy to be a part of the stoner community, bro. I think that's got a great sound to it. Co-owner Rodney Schrodek is a childhood friend of Marcos and was born in Poland near the Ukrainian border, where more than one million Ukrainian refugees have now crossed. A lot of women and children that were, you know, opening with open arms trying to give them some uh, safe haven. With their pot and pierogi fundraiser, they expect to raise thousands of dollars for UNICEF. The organization is on the ground helping families fleeing the war, and on Sunday, their first shipment of medical supplies arrived in Lviv. But this coming Sunday, these local business owners hope to show their support for Ukraine from Detroit using pot and pierogi. It feels Yo, know, yeah, that's that's God dope, bro. You give a nigga some weed, and then you also give them some shit to handle their munchies afterwards, bro. Uh, pierogies, pierogies ain't my favorite thing, bro. But um, yeah, if I was in Detroit, bro, I'd be going over there to buy some, bro. Yo, if you if you in Detroit, bro, and you a stoner, you part of the bird club, bro, go buy some pot and pierogies from uh Luxury Loud. Yo, um, long as they ain't, long as they ain't like, nah, I mean, charging the arm and the leg and shit for that shit, bro. Cause you know, you know, being part of the bird club don't mean you gonna be paying the old extra, uh, extra, uh, markups on no dank just because, bro. I don't give a fuck if it's a good cause or not, to my dude. Um, long as your prices are fair, bro. Bird club support pot and pierogies, but bro, let these niggas now, I mean, be charging some crazy shit, bro. We ain't, we ain't, we ain't doing that shit, bro. It's good, you know. I wish I could do more, but it's a start. It starts. We can do it and we'll fight. And like we say, Slava Ukraini, which is uh, glory to Ukraine. Now, in order to come inside and purchase cannabis, you must have a medical card, but anyone is allowed to come out in the parking lot and purchase some raffle tickets and also buy some pierogi in Corktown. Oh, shit. All right. So you can't even go in there unless you got medical. All right. Um, but but y'all can still go. Y'all can go to the, uh, and I mean, the, uh, the uh, parking lot and get some pierogies and uh, what, what did they call them shit? Some snitch juice or some uh, kielbasa's. And shit like that. So yeah, bro. Stoners, bro. 
Look, uh, if you in Detroit, bro, make your way to Luxury Loud, bro, and go ahead and uh buy some pierogies. You know what I mean? Support, support, support Ukraine, bro. I'm all at y'all, bro. Down to the Marley, I'm out.